most beautiful face. Doesn't he? He, does. he like really does. Symmetric. Like, I don't think I've ever seen a more beautiful face. He, I told yeah. her last night, oh, he needs, Allison needs to get him in a Target ad. <laughs> He's perfect. You're like a little model. You're so cute. Oh, he doesn't like me touching him. He's actually <laughs> very friendly. Jesus. Yeah, he is a, he's, he's a love. He's a lover. <clears throat> do you want to do it, Dave, the, the Christmas story? Yeah. Are you periscoping, Mike? Yeah. Yeah, we're live. Roger. Oh, look. Hi, Roger. 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 So little. What kind of cat is it? I'm not even sure. Uh, short hair. He's on 101.3, Mike? Yes. Okay. <laughs> well, we're having a great time in the studio this morning. Not only am I playing with my brand new metal detector, a yeah. gift from Steve-O. Susan, which, you're welcome. Uh, I'm throwing stuff on the floor and then detecting to see whether I can find. So far, it's found scissors. It's found coins. What? And, uh, and it found some keys, too. So I'm pretty excited about that. Then also, um, I, with Fallon's help, I adopted a new cat. A little kitten named Roger, Roger about 10 days ago because Fallon is on the board for Paws for Paws, which is like a pet re rescue organization. Mm -hmm. And they found a cat named Roger. And they're like, oh, Fallon's like, look at this. Here's little Roger. He's a little 10 week old kitten. And I was like, oh, he's so cute. <laughs> so within 24 hours, he was ours. He is and the most perfect. It's weird because, well, I like cats anyway, but he seriously has the most perfect face and features. Yeah, it's a beautiful cat. It's you got to call cute. Allison, your daughter, and get him in a Target ad. Yeah. She works over Target. Um, so we're periscoping cat right now at 1013 <laughs> KDWB. He's making his way around the studio. He loves the Hillary Nutcracker. He yeah. loves Susan. You can tell he's already a mama's boy. Yeah, he does love Susan. Susan is, is the leftover mothering instincts that were from uh, <laughs> the, all the other kids. Um, uh, she is using them now on the little little kitten. <laughs> and talk about spoiled. Oh, and we got yeah. a problem with this cat. I told you about this problem earlier. This cat is super aggressive when you're eating. The cat. How is he aggressive? Well, dogs will sit on the floor and look up at you and beg. Yeah, and beg. The cat will jump up on your lap, get up in your food, walk right into your bowl or plate or stick his head in your glass of milk or whatever it is, and he really doesn't not uh, he doesn't understand that that's not his. So he mm -hmm. smells food. And either we forgot to feed him. Oh, we've forgotten to feed him. That's what it is. We've never fed him. Or he's just got, he's really ill-mannered. So what should we do? Squirt it with a squirt bottle? I don't know. That's what I said, but fire someone said I was mean. I'm going to have a fire extinguisher next to me when I'm eating. So when he starts to bother me, I'll spray him with a fire extinguisher. That seems reasonable he's to me. He's playing with so. a ribbon. <laughs> he's so cute. Yeah, he's adorable. Uh, you can see him on Periscope at 1013KDWB. We're going to do Thalonies coming up in a few minutes, but first of all, um, it is Christmas time, mm -hmm. and um, you know the story of Christmas and how Christmas all came about and the origins of Christmas, and, and if you went to Sunday school or church or vacation Bible school, you know all this stuff because it's one of the first things you learn. It's like Noah's Ark and the story of Christmas and Easter and some of the, just the regular things you learn. My wife never went to church as a kid. Her parents never took her to Sunday school, so anything of the Bible or Easter or Christmas, she kind of maybe knows a little bit, but not a lot. But not a lot, <laughs> and certainly most of it not accurate. Here is Susan's version of the Christmas story. Here we go. All right, Roger, I'm gonna see a picture of you for Twitter. There was a king, Roger. and he had a big city named Bethlehem, and there were these two married Roger. couples. Our one married couple married so God, and the king oh. was. <laughs> is that you? No, it's Tommy. Tommy. Oh, it's Tommy that did that? Yeah. Squirrely little thing. Mid bed. Found out that day at the celebration yeah. that she was. <laughs> He's sneaky. Too, too happy because she Roger. was really crabby. Oh, good. No, go back to the hospital. Uh, but. They went ahead and went to the big festival that the king was having. See if all of them are blurry, and blurry, that blurry. Night, they were done with the celebration. They thought they had a room yeah. at a hotel, but there wasn't any. So they found this barn, and people from the celebration the king, and the king went to the barn too because they heard that Mary had the okay. baby. I nailed it, I think. And they brought gifts to the baby. Do we have to just go right into the song? I did, I got the first one. Oh, look at this one. Yeah. We're actually meowing. Christmas song, though. <laughs> 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 I'm sure this shit. 
<laughs> he looks psychotic. Uh, but these are cute. That one's cute. What song? Uh, I don't know. Um, uh, oh my God. Should a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and Insane. That night, she had Ten seconds. A and from that point forward, the king came to the Roger, you psycho. I think my favorite inaccuracy in there is the baby blanket with the name Jesus <laughs> sewn into it, which I'm pretty sure they didn't bring that nor a block of gold. <laughs> what was the other thing? She said a fruit basket? <laughs> that, um, that, she got the end part right. She talked yeah. about Bethlehem. That's right. Yeah, Bethlehem, right? The yeah. king did call, I believe it was Nebuchadnezzar. There was nothing about the North Star, which I was surprised. No, uh, no, huh? Uh, was it Nebuchadnezzar that uh, brought everybody to uh, the, for a census? I think it was for a census. Probably. Census. Oh, yeah, that's why they were there. They weren't there because of the birth. They were there because they needed to be counted. Yeah, they had to be counted. So they yeah. came to town, and yeah. she's pregnant, and Joseph's yeah. like, oh, yeah, she's pregnant. Well, she's a virgin. That's kind of weird. Yeah. So, um, so then they come, and there's no room at the inn or something like mm -hmm. that. So, that? Um, so they then go down to the manger. Yeah, which well, I think she said the barn. She said the barn, which is yeah, the same thing. It's the same. Cause they have a and then she uh, puts in a little, little, um, a little um, uh, trough, a little trough, or trough? A manger or something like that. And then, mm -hmm. uh, then now this always confused me: is how long did they stay there? Because I thought it was just a night. Them, well, see, I would have thought it just night too. But then the three kings, the three wise men come. Yeah. They come, you know, riding up on their camels. It would have taken them a couple of days to get there. Don't you think that the they would have been traveling? But then the angels they came and told the shepherds. Mm -hmm. And then they, I don't know how the kings found out though. Well, they found out they because the angels. Star. I thought they, they were very told by the angels. Yeah. Okay. We three was it the North kings star? of Orient are. Uh, was, it the, was it the North Star though? I think so. Or it was the Star of David. Know. Star David. Well, yeah, I don't know. Was it the Star of David? I don't remember. It was a star they followed. They did follow a star, I think. Okay. It was the Lions. That or uh, Google Maps. Or Google Maps. Yeah. Thank you. Well, that was probably and using Apple there, Maps at first. What what, what, what they what they bring when they brought what were the three gifts that they brought? I mean, gold, gold frankincense, frankincense, and myrrh. And myrrh. Yeah. What is myrrh? myrrh. Uh, it's like canned canned goods. Can, oh, uh, canned goods. Yeah. Okay. Like spam, you're sort you're of. like a carrot pea combo kind of can. That's what myrrh is. Yeah. Good to know. We're not positive. Yeah, but, yeah, it but good. we think so. This Here's drink to me. In sync. Bbb. Enter nice in there. Squirrel! Where'd he go? What are you doing with Roger when you're on vacation? Um, Allison. Oh. Except for Justin's kind of allergic to cats. <laughs> and oh, well, she has well, Roger's hair is so short. Home. And I said, you've got to keep him like comfortable with people. Don't let Justin like shove him in the closet. So I'm a little nervous about it. Yeah. I don't think Justin wants something. I've done so far. When are you back? I get back on the 29th. Oh, sure. You're staying away. Yeah. Well, that's a Tuesday, right? Yeah. In case there's an issue. Yep. Glad you come. <laughs> you really can, yeah. I'll tell her it is. She'll be home Saturday, Sunday with Justin. If, like, so. Justin blows up, <laughs> his face is all swollen. I know. Roger, he's too little, little to take to a kennel. Is he super vocal? Not really. Only when he's hungry. He goes into the laundry room and when he's hungry, he'll let you know. You have so much fur. Well, you own a cat without fur. Hi, you want a treat. I wish I would have brought some. Come here. My special little kitten. Mm -hmm. Isn't he so cute? He, he really does. It's like perfect. You could be a model. Oh. <laughs> Do you want to go walk on your dad's head? You want to hold him, don't you? <laughs> I can tell. Oh my gosh. Ah, what's going on, brother? What's going on, brother? You're like cats for I'm a cat guy. Are you? I've been looking at cats for a while. <gasps> you let me know. I can get you any oh kind of cat. Gosh. I need like a calico of sorts, <laughs> long haired. Seriously, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You what? What? How old? Kitten? Uh, Roger and, age? And, uh, well, kitten would be dope, but I, you know, if there's like a six year old one, it's all like. <gasps> Roger. Roger. Hey. Jordan, you just need to be ready. I'm so ready. <laughs> I got the cutest one ever. <laughs> oh, that is cute. Seriously, oh, Roger, you're freaking perfect. out. Cute. He's so you know, with Susan, perfect. you want to go with Dave? Go to Mom. He loves his mama. He's so cute. His coat. 
phenomenal. Yes. Is that, is that um, tea tree soap and tea tree shampoo? Is that yes. Like, yeah, yeah, tree, yes. Mitchell, some Paul yes. Mitchell. Paul Mitchell, yes, yes. yes. Paul Wait, Mitchell, is a thank you. Dessert. I think it's the best. Aww. Yeah, it's not to be ASAP. Italian food. Yes. Valid, you're valid. No, I really actually have only have one. Yeah, you can look at this. Okay, are you guys done seeing him? I no. So. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. sure. Mm, here we go. Let's do Okay, I'm heading out then. Okay. Hi, Raj. Hi, little buddy. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's already the KFC one. Where's the carrier outside? Yeah, just right there. Oh. Hi, Raj. Hi, little buddy. You're it? Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right, I'll see you at home.